Greetings everybody, Scully here, welcoming you to our free-to-play challenge of Star Wars The Old Republic. And we are here on Tatooine. We have five Datacrons, three lore objects, two codex entries that I want to make sure we get, and maybe a partridge in the pear tree, I'm not really sure. So our first one, I think we've already started this planet, but I totally missed one. And where am I at? Hopefully I'm on Tatooine. Ah, gotta go this way. The first one is right up here. The history of Tatooine. It's kind of dark and hard to see. Hope, hopefully you guys can make it out. All you gotta do is just walk up to it. And even though it is up there, you can still get it. On the map that is right here. Inside the spaceport. So that is our first lore object. And now, we're going to go do something a little bit harder. Let's head over and get our Datacron somewhere over in that area. This Datacron is a lot of jumping, so there will be a lot of editing, because I am terrible at platforming. I think all the others are going to be fairly easy, though one of them is a balloon ride, and that one is going to take a long time, so there's going to be a lot of editing on that one as well. i got to remember where it's at. I think down over here. I think it's right in this area. And I must be wrong. I will go ahead and fast forward it till I find it. Okay, I found where we start. It's uh, right here on these rocks. Took me a little bit to find her, but I, I, I drove uh, right past it. Like I said, this part is going to take a whole lot of editing. So if we open up our map, we are right here. And there's going to be a lot of jumps, like I said, a lot of editing, because I'm terrible at platforming. So let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so if you're with me so far, this yellow cog, just want to jump up on here and make another jump. And we're going to try to go in from this pole over to that pipe and up there on that wall. And then we're trying to get to that little uh, indention right there and on over into that wall. I'm oh, sorry, this pipe and then that place. Ooh, that was close. Mater. Gotten lucky so far. And then I can't remember if it's this way. Yeah, this looks good. So you're looking for right around in here. Just jump down here, jump back up. Datacron should be right on the other side of this, I believe. Oh, wait, there it is, right there. It's on the map. 
it is right in front of us. Can't believe I did this in one try so far. And you can tell by looking down here. Yeah, I got extremely lucky jumping on those pipes. If you look down here, you can tell it's 106. I believe it was 101 or 102 when I picked up the first lore object. So I got her in one try, but I was extremely lucky. This one usually takes me quite a while. And this Datacron is on this building right outside all of these uh, vendors and um, trainers. So you can see it from here, but uh, I'll show you guys where it actually starts at. So now, I can't believe that went so well. Now I've already hooked up our class and our story quest. Let's go ahead and go to the Isabeau. You know what? I need to go back to the starport real quick. I wasn't looking for quests. Should have been looking for quests. I'll go ahead and fast forward so I get to the entrance. Okay, I made it all the way back and I don't see any quests, so I'm going to cut the video here and I'll bring you guys back when I get to this speeder because I don't think there's, there's no quests on this side and I don't think there were any over here. Okay, it looks like we do have a quest at the speeder area. Go ahead and pick it up. Criminals and vagabonds. Everywhere on Tatooine, the Empire's great works are besieged by criminals and vagabonds. Major Vesa, you have a guest. My lord, such an unexpected pleasure. Guided to this backwards province to bring order and discipline, no doubt? Bring me up to speed. As I was just explaining to the lazy sots in my command, the Exchange Crime Syndicate is flagrantly defying the Empire's directives. They're banned by Imperial law, yet they've given refuge here to dozens of murderers, spice dealers. They've even started processing spice outside Mos Illa, and yet my men refuse to act. But, sir, we lost 15 men in our last attempt. Quiet! I am well versed in this company's many failures. Clearly, I must turn elsewhere to see Imperial law restored. I can teach this scum to properly respect the Empire. Excellent. A Sith will prove a powerful lesson. The job is simple. The spice processing operation outside Mos Illa must be completely obliterated, and its guards killed as a lesson. With their men dead and machinery destroyed, the message will be clear. I look forward to seeing you when it is done. That quest is right over here. We'll go ahead and knock that out. And before I do that, there is one thing I want to get, and you guys are going to need it as well. What can I get for you? This right here, the Zerga VX736 injector. Buy one of those. Hold on to it. We will Come get to that anytime. later. If not, this video it will be the next one. That is a codex entry that we're going to want. I'm going to stop off real quick and kill this guy. If I die, I'm going to haunt you. OK. 
kill at least one of everything and that will help you keep from having to backtrack so much. Feral Reek. Does the trick. And that opened up a quest for us. A little bit of a bonus. And there's something else I forgot to do. It is right here. Combat proficiencies. I've already decided I want this one right here. Overwhelm. Good. Finish up our quest here. Yeah, better blow a cooldown. I am. Oh, we might actually die here. So we can pull it off. Nope. Terrible. We do have five probes. Uh, yeah, let's go ahead. I don't think I actually got that cooldown off. I, I hit the button, but I think I actually hit the wrong button. I think I hit this one, and I meant to hit this one right here, our save reward. That was my fault. Let's get away from all these people. And heal up. Yeah, it took on a bit more than I could chew. I should have sent my companion in there, because that was a whole lot of aggro, and our gear is pretty bad. Uh, matter of fact, look at our lightsaber. Level 8 lightsaber. So, our gear is definitely hurting. This always does the trick. But, uh, definitely, I think if I would have used uh, my skills a little bit better planning instead of just jumping in there, we could have pulled it off. She takes that damage a lot better than we do. What is that? Our second death now, I believe. I forget what the first one was from. I remember we tried to take on the world boss and was it Bal Balmora? Let's choke that guy. Uh, I think that is it. Let's head over here and work on that one. Knock out our class and our story quest. Hopefully these guys don't dismount us on the way there. I think this is something that we're going to end up coming back to after we get to another planet, but I just want to check it out. Yeah, that's that's for something. I'm not even sure that we're going to be able to do that, but we will probably attempt that in a later video. Definitely need to get our levels up, though. I can't even remember what it entails, other than I do believe it ends up fighting a... a boss, and I think that was like a, a three- or four-man fight. And we're trying to get to right there. Let's go ahead and kill some of these. Complete. Kill some of these guys real quick. If I die, I'm going to haunt you. 
And that opened up another quest. Might as well get it. We're right here. Don't really need it unless it... Well, it looked like it might have had some gear, so that might help us out. Perfection delivered, Master. Yeah, we need one more. Let's get this group right here. Alright, now we need to get inside. Oh, there it is. The world is weeping, and the tears evaporate in the heat of our sins. I think you mean from the heat of our suns, Isabeau. No, child. There is a dark presence newly arrived on Tatooine. Ah, Sith. You made it. The hostels outside were no match for you, I see. Sorry if I tracked blood in on your floor. The world is an hourglass, ever being turned. The sands wipe away all traces of the past. You are the seeker Sharak spoke of. You wish to understand the Jedi's purpose in the lair of the sand demon. You see it correctly. My eyes may be aged and failing. But my mind sees. Please, Isabeau, make haste. Tell my friend what you know. I will remain here after to hear your wisdom. Fine. Gather close. Few are aware that Tatooine was once a place of positive force energy. Jedi made pilgrimages here to renew and purify. The sands speak of a ritual called the Demon's Blood. This is likely what the Jedi that Sharak witnessed was engaged in. Explain this ritual. The demon's blood. A Jedi seeking enlightenment would cover himself in fresh sand demon blood and enter the village of the Savage Ones. Cowering before the demon slayer, the Savage Ones would reveal the path to self-discovery and to that which the slayer seeks. Do you mean the sand people? Tatooine makes most who come here savage. And the Sand People have been here all along. Isabeau, as I told you, the girl faced the beast but left it unwounded. There must be another way to bathe in the beast's blood. But you'll have to discover that for yourself, if you care to. To know where this Jedi girl went, you'll have to perform the ritual yourself, and then see if the Savage Ones speak. I appreciate your help and insights. Step lightly on my desert. It has been through so much in its life. Here are the coordinates you will need. After you face the Sand Demon, I will meet you at the Sand People compound. If the legend is true, and the Sand People have something to offer you, I wish to see it with my own eyes. And that requires an expansion, so we're going to take those tokens. And how are we doing on that? Almost halfway full. I need to send those guys back out again. And all these are green, so we'll go ahead and go with the light side points. Your confidence is not misplaced. Perfection is my goal, Master. And check our inventory, because, well, never mind. We won't do that yet. We'll wait till we get back to town. I was going to equip gear and all that, but I've got too much trash and it would take me a minute. Let's see where we gotta go. Right there. Tell you what, let's go ahead and do this. No. Actually, we won't. I'm gonna wait. Uh, there's a better spot.
Alright, so we have a quest now. That's yeah, quite a bit of killing. Ah, uh, missed. Oh, I should have saved Force Choke for that guy. Yeah, I'll go ahead and blow a cool down here and take them all on. I'm not sure I even needed to blow a cool down. I don't think I had most of the aggro. But I don't want to die again. Looks like we can get some of our killing done inside, so we'll go ahead and head there in just a second. Come on, bring it. Oh, got it done. Nice. That yeah, wasn't too bad. Might as well get some of these guys because I think there's another quest. This always does the trick. Yeah, I might want to use a cooldown right there because that's a lot of enemies. Quest is right here. Oh, I thought we'd get a bonus quest, but I guess not. Good idea to take out those droids. I believe they heal. Now yeah, we give this guy a force choke. Yeah, go ahead and heal up. And yeah, we're trying to get to right there. I am Frere Wong, of the Sons of Palawa. You have won this battle, and I call for parley. You brutalized our keepings. Tell us why our wives and children weep. 
so that this feud may be honorable. Your battle droids had data I required. Then you fight for resources. There are worse causes. We know about the Empire's expedition. Whatever you're after, you won't find it. The desert protects its own. And though we can't keep you from departing, beware Tatooine, and beware our vengeance. You've made an enemy today. Vengeance can wait. For now, we can part in peace. Go. We have injured to tend to, and graves to dig. We'll meet again soon enough. And I think we're going to teleport. Let me look at the map real quick. Yeah, let's go ahead and teleport. Probably the spaceport, if not the cantina. And let's go to the cantina. So on the map we are headed to right here. Darth Silf Slither. What's wrong here? I can sense your fear. Sorry, my lord. I'm I'm remembering that time on Zyast, when I was buried alive. That's good. Use that fear, Hale. Let it push you. Ah, did you bring us the droid mines? I have what you asked for. I sense we'll do incredible things together. Zerka's discovery is out there somewhere, sending ripples through the Force. Let's get the Verba brains analyzed, my lord. Kila. Memory wipe destroyed the old files, but it looks like the sons of Palawa bought the droids from Jawas. All right. Guess that makes the Jawas our next lead to the Zerka base. Would the Jawas trade with the sons? They'll sell their goods to anyone. Mos Ela was originally their trading post. The Jawas are one of the native species, primitive masters of machinery. They swarm like rats during the trade season, selling droid parts and generators. Then it's back to the desert. In my dreams, I see one band that remains in the wastes near this city. Find them. I must meditate. As you decree, my lord. You may go. Show the Verba brain to the Jawas. See if they can't identify the source. They won't have records, but they're clever. Good hunting. Stay hydrated, stay safe, and stay cautious. And there's an upgrade for us. We will equip that here in just a minute. Go ahead and send our pets back out again. And we're finally on to Tier 4. I will finish shortly. Yeah, I didn't really want the dark side, but I'm going to go ahead and send it out. is my goal, Master. Want to get that done as quickly as possible. So we're headed back down to the speeder, and that'll take us a few minutes. I'll go ahead and fast forward this. Look sharp, men. This is what success looks like. An entire exchange operation crushed like an insect. May your accomplishment inspire them to do their own jobs half as well. I have completed my task then. Our Empire's standing will be much improved thanks to your work. Farewell. Now 
know, I want to do that codex entry for the Womp Rats here, but it uh, looks like they're killing them off. Well, I, I, there's a better spot for it. Go ahead what and can sell, I get our, for you? sell our stuff here. Come back anytime. Man, we had some stuff to equip. Okay, that's garbage, garbage, garbage. And I want that one. We're a DPS class, so go ahead and put that on. And sell off the remainders. You won't find a better bargain. Come back anytime. And now what I'm going to do is go ahead and give my pets all of these, and I'll bring you guys back as soon as I'm done. Okay, I went ahead and gave them all those, except these, because my companions aren't back yet. And the reason I did that is because they were all grade 3 or lower, and we're on grade 5 now. So we are headed to right here. We got some stuff to do over there, but we're gonna wait. We're gonna go ahead and knock out this to Camp Canali. Okay, and here's where we can get the Womp Rat. Go ahead and show us on the map. There's there's other places you can do it, but I just I found a pretty good group of them right here, so we'll do it here. And for those that need that item right there, circa VX736 injector, you can get that at the speeder in most Isla speeder. There's a vendor, I think it was called the stem vendor that you can buy that from. And I think you can actually buy that from any vendor on this planet. So just uh, don't use it yet, but you will need that here in just a second. I'm going to go ahead and dismiss our companion. See ya! And this is a chance on hit, so we might actually die, but we don't want to attack them. We want them to hit us. And we're looking for a buff down here. Go ahead and use a cooldown for my defenses. This is uh, probably a lot easier for healing classes. Just let them hit you. Like I said, it's a chance on hit for them to infect you. Go ahead and use another cooldown here. And it looks like we're probably going to die. Yep, we died. I'll go ahead and go to the med center and I'll be right back here. Ready for your next order. Okay, we got we got light side. Okay, I'll fast forward back to the Womp Rats. I'm actually gonna run away. You'll miss me. Dismiss my companion. Yeah, let's try that again. Go ahead and use my defensive cooldowns. And the higher level you are, your defenses are higher, so there's less less likely that they're actually gonna hit you. So this is actually easier for a lower level tune. And we died again. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and skip that for now. I'll show you guys another area because it uh, it might actually depend on the type of Womp Rat as well. So we'll go ahead and carry on with our story and uh, we will show that off later. Go ahead and fast forward this for you guys. And we made it right outside the instance. Let's talk to this little Jawa, see what he's got to say.
Wama uto jakoga uto pawa tu bamba wola. Jawa, I have parts here from a droid you sold. I need them identified. Kokola kopana kejaka. Magusa no pachonki fa guta jioto india. Look at this as an opportunity to work with the Empire. You might come out ahead. I clear your path and you tell me what I need. Okay, that's not too far, I see. I think that is right outside the instance. And if memory serves us well, we also get another quest. I think if we kill some of the droids and stuff that are around that area. Just kind of a little bonus. Yeah, there's nothing here. I thought there were droids or something guarding it. No, obviously there usually is because that's there. I think somebody else might have already been here. Probably that player that we passed. And the last one right over here. Head back and turn that back to the Jawa and see if we can't get something out of it. What say you, Mr. Thint? I've cleared the path. Your band should be able to travel now. Tell me more of this. You've done well, Jawa. Let's see how far we got. We gotta go all the way back to town, so I'm gonna go ahead and pick up when we get there. Okay, we are back at the speeder, and our destination is right here. Go ahead and fast forward this for you guys. And we made it. All right, everyone get the equipment packed. Hail, see to the speeders. My lord, it's good to see you. Were you able to make contact with the Jawas? I was able to negotiate for what we needed. Looks like a stasis crate. The sort Zerka used to transport samples. Won't be easy to unseal, but we can peek inside. Keela, running through the analysis grid. On it. We'll keep the sensitivity low. Don't want to pulverize any artifacts inside. Definitely something in there. Alien device of some sort, roughly spherical, contained in a Zerka energy field. Blasted odd. What about it is odd? First pass shows the artifact is over 10,000 years old. Probably distortion. The energy readings are unstable. Give me a few days to pop it open, and we'll run the scan again. I won't bore you with the science. Lord Siltha's on a pilgrimage, and we're getting ready to move to the forward research outpost. But we may need you again soon. This mission isn't over. I'd like to see it through. If you're heading to the desert, contact us at the first station out from Mos Ila. Lord Siltha should have a lead on the Zerka base by then. In the meantime, we've got an artifact to study.
wants us to use the hollow terminal. I think that's outside of town. Yep, that's going to be over there. So, I will fast forward it because I have to get from this speeder all the way up to here. So, uh, actually, I'll probably end up cutting that part out. And I'll bring you guys back in as soon as I land at the speeder. Alright, we made her back in. We got a codex entry for coming here, and there was something I was... Oh yes, our buffs wore off because we were dying uh, to those Womp Rats on our failed attempt, but we will get that done. Don't worry about that. Let's go ahead and see what this guy's got for us. Nebaga imana naki naya bila maknam unya kam nalebek. Naya memgem kaligam gegwa nam karak naya memak. Kam inu nemuk, naja naya akam memnik miraka. What kind of Nemoidian orders around Imperials? Memundia nepeb jang, hapakra wama nimpam. Laporam amka, mamni nikag, nagnaya mamni kamgram. Kala jiwa nimok, ebemgam nyama naya aikam. If this technology is valuable, it should go first to the Sith. Naya Narankam. Kala Ama Mani Mami. Lebig Bak. Memgam Gamgi. Nina Gegwan. Amnerna Hanak. Nemua Bemguana. Kumia Yang Memgamba Paka. Alright, so he wants us to test something out. We have another objective right here. I believe it's a hollow terminal. This is Captain Gola, Reclamation Service Outpost 701. It's good to see you, my lord. My team's still searching for the Zerka base, but we've hit a snag that, frankly, we can't handle ourselves. Bring me up to speed. After you left for the Jawas, Lord Silfar had a vision. Something about the natives, the sand people. He flew a speeder into the Dune Sea, but we lost the tracking signal in an energy storm. Silfar was summoning lightning. Why would Silfar go out there alone? Lord Silfar was following a dream, the same way he found the lost temple of Zeost and the crystal caves of Molivar. He told me the sand people and their spirit guides were the key. He was looking for some sort of compass, the natives, what are they? What could they do to Silfar? I don't know. They're savages. Still, I wouldn't think they could kill him alone. Find the spirit guides and find him. When you have answers, come to our forward outpost. Otherwise, I don't know how this mission can succeed. And one more quest over here. I don't remember if that was a flashpoint or what. Let's go find out. That is a flashpoint. We're not doing that right now. Alright, so what we got? We need to go over here and test out that thing. I think there's another quest over here as well. I can't remember what this quest is. And apparently it's not here. Oh, we'll figure that out later. Oh, actually, I, I do. Re that's a daily quest, if I remember right. And we've already got all the dailies. What is this? This is a diseased womp rat. And there's a Jedlin and a Jedlin. You know what? This guy is. No, I thought he was diseased. Maybe not. My bad, I thought it said disease. Carry on. Alright, let's start out with killing some of these guys. And that opened up a quest for us. Oh 
Like I said, I like to take out those flying droids first because they, I, I believe, they heal. Let's go ahead and activate this. They give us another quest. We need to target, I believe, these guys. Use it. Alright, so we need five more of those. And go ahead and heal up. Don't need more deaths than I've already had. Oh, we probably will die a few more times in our playthrough. Alright, so we need two more of the non aggro ones. This ought to do it right here. If I die, I'm going to haunt you. And before we go turn it in, let's go ahead and work on these. Demon blood. Actually, I want to... Well, let's go ahead and kill this guy real quick. Boom. Not sure if we need him, so we'll go ahead and do it. Oh, don't hit me. Hit her. Alright. Yeah, let's get this guy as well. Make sure we get as much beast lore as we can. That's a pretty long tunnel. I'll go ahead and fast forward it. Alright, so we just came through that tunnel. And we're going to... Let's go ahead and start by killing these guys. Better check I still have all my parts. That is a lot of sand people. Is there anything else here we need? Sand people. Defeat the sand people and <laughs> go and get the demon blood. Alright, so let's go ahead and start killing these sand people. for a compass off of the <laughs> excuse me off of these guys give them a little force choke there there is our compass and what are these these are more sand oh that's their pets okay kill a few more of these guys and then we're gonna go do another quest Alright, so we only need seven more sand people. Let's go ahead and start working on this quest down here. Oh, you know what? I need to hit this button right here. There we go. Alright, let's go after that demon blood. Should be right in this, I believe this is an instance right here. Yep, there it is. Go ahead and see if we get a bonus here. Nope, no bonus. Oh, there we go. 
we go. Need four more of those. I guess that's only the big ones. Give him a force choke. So we need what one more, not two more. And that looks like the quest. I'm gonna wait on that one. Let's go ahead and get two more of these guys real quick. Level 37, goodness, slow down the levels. Can we talk for a second? I really don't have a good feeling about this. I'll make you feel better later. Uh, we're about to face a monster that can swallow us whole. I'm thinking, if the Jedi perform the demon blood ritual without a fight, there must be a way we can too. As a favor to me, could we please get through this without mixing it up with the sand demon? I was already planning on doing that. Oh good. That's a relief. Looks like it's showtime. The monster's caught a whiff of us. I'm ready to back you up if it goes badly. Desert monster, I stand my ground. I will not run! Look into my eyes, beast. You are now my pet. No oh boy, uh, I guess I didn't choose the right one. Uh, let's go ahead and stun him. And work on the small ones. Alright, we got that done. Let's get out of his AoE there. Let Vet handle that for a second. Alright, oh man. That could have been ugly. Look at her, she's almost down to half health. Oh, yuck! So much blood! If I knew we were gonna literally bathe in it, I would have waited outside. And the smell. Oh, Kag! We're gonna stink for days! Oh, what if it never wears off? It will be alright, Fett. I sure hope you're right. I take a lot of pride in my hygiene. So, let's get out of the stink pit, huh? You took the words out of my mouth. Lead the way. And there's a beast tree. Yeah, so note to self, don't pet demons on the head. Bad idea. And we still need seven more Tuscans. We will get that. Let's see, can we mount? Nope, can't mount up. I'll go ahead and fast forward till we get outside. Alright, so we're killing a few more sand be demons. We need seven more. Let's go ahead and get started. Come on, bring it. And we only need one more. Let's head over here.
find Darth Silthar. Alright, we got that done. Forty, wow, that's a lot. Boy, it is dark in here. Brutal. Better check I still have all my parts. There's a whole lot of combat. Eh, better heal up. take out that guy first and CC that one and well I was gonna work on the other one now I guess we'll take this one Almost halfway done on those sand people. I don't think there's enough of them in here though. Maybe wrong. Yeah. Let's go over here and get our quest out of the way. Lord Silva. Did Captain Gona send you? Such a good man. Hey. A pity he didn't send young Hale, but the honor is yours. <coughs> you will hear my last words. Slowly, you're not going to die, my lord. It is kind of you to lie. The Force called me into the desert. I sensed what Circa found. An alien power. I saw a white room. I thought the Sand People would know the land's secrets. I murdered them stole their thoughts to find this cave. I knew victory before they destroyed me. Is there anything I can do? My journey here was not for nothing. Zerka built its base over a site from the natives' myths. A forbidden land. The paintings in the cave show the way. Find them. Record them. Gola and his men, they... <sighs> Your journey's over, Lord Silphar. Find the paintings, but beware. Beware the thing in the White Room. Okay, let's go ahead and uh, probably better rest up real quick. And we'll knock out that guy right there. Probably shouldn't be looting all that stuff, it's kind of pointless. So I think now, unless I see a green item on the ground, I probably won't. And how is our force choke? Ooh, not good. Well, we will see what happens. This always does the trick. That wasn't too bad. And what we're looking for is that flag right there. Still need 20 more kills. Eh, I can't mount up, so I'll go ahead and fast forward till we get outside.
Okay, we're right outside the instance, and we're going to work on getting 20 more... Wait, what was... <clears throat> yep, work on getting 20 more kills real quick. I have a fear of dying in the belly of a beast. Okay, let's go ahead and heal up a little bit. We're getting close. We need 11 more kills. If I die, I'm going to haunt you. Getting there. Six more to go. Yeah, we only need one more. There we go, right there. That was force choke. Choke him up. Now yeah, we need the water supplies, and there's one of them right there. Actually, there's two of them. One over there. Looks like there might be two over there. So we should be done. We'll get that one right there. Then we get to go fight another boss. Not not a boss, a, a strong. This always does the trick. Wow, those guys appeared out of nowhere. And he should be right here. I don't see him though. Might have to wait on a spawn. I'll go ahead and cut out the weight and bring you guys. Oh, never mind. There he is, right there. Well, we kept him CC'd for quite a while. Alright, I think that is it. Let's see, what is this? It goes out of the tunnel. Oh, no, we need to go do that. Drill the Padawan. Go ahead and fast forward this for you guys. Okay, we're right outside the instance. Trail of the Padawan, Demon's Blood. This is the Sith Warrior quest. Little skull there to click on. I trailed and observed your descent here. I could not believe my eyes. The sand people all ran from you. What transpired inside the sand demon cave that makes this so? I have no idea why the sand people ran. 
Now that I see you close up, I can guess. You have the demon's blood all over you. Its essence follows you. Now, Isabeau said that this is where your path will be illuminated. But there doesn't seem to be anything here. Wait! On your guard, Offworlder. One of the Sand People approaches. I will respond in kind. I've never seen one of the Sand People approach an outsider in peace. This parchment the Sand Person brought is remarkable. It is a crude but very clear map of the desert. It marks a door carved into the wall of the Desert Wound Ravine. But I've mapped this ravine and there is no such door. If this is where the Padawan went, I must follow. I shudder to think what awaits you there. The ravine marks the farthest I or anyone I know of has dared venture. Here are the coordinates. I will follow stealthed using the dune shadows. Think first of your own safety, and do not follow if it becomes too harrowing. Your concern is appreciated. Darth Barris enlisted my services to be scout and lookout, and I intend to do my job. Head deeper into the desert, and you will find the Desert Wound Ravine. Safe journey. I guess we're taking the data crystals now. We should be all done. So that goes through the tunnel and back outside. Yep. And do we have our quick travel? Awesome. So we'll quick travel back to the Verith. And turn in our quest right over here for this guy. Your device worked well. The droids are destroyed. Mamni lebek bak manuk. Meraka naja ki nama bamyak. Bragam nemya inubuyen. A kamamka amka nanya. Now I think we got quite a ways to go. And it is well, you know what? Let's go ahead. Let's let's keep on going. I was gonna end the video, but I think we'll we'll keep on going for just a bit longer. Just kind of looking around at these womp rats. I, I'm looking for a disease. Maybe we'll have a higher chance. Matter of fact, I think it might be in here. Well, rather than wasting too much time, I'm going to go ahead and fast forward to our next area. Alright, I made it to the next area and there's uh, some quests right here. I think there's a speeder up here as well. I may be wrong. Well, let's go ahead and pick up some quests. Wow, I bet you don't need a cannon to flatten a bunker. Still, this might interest you. Navy just deployed the next generation prototype of our top orbital strike weapon. She's a real beauty, let me tell you. I'm supposed to be overseeing test firing against hard targets in the area, but we're on indefinite standby until conditions improve. Why do we hesitate? The exchange is seriously entrenched out here, but they're protecting their strongholds with a wide area signal jammer. It means our targeting systems are useless, even the handheld close-up targeters. You want this jammer taken out of the picture? You got it in one. Once that jammer's out of commission, we can blow up anything we want, any time we want. You with me on this? You could be the first to debut this beauty's ten kiloton wrath. It's only fitting that I have this honor. You're honoring the entire project with your support, my lord. The exchange leaders are the only ones with access to the jammer. Their security spikes would let you shut it down. With the jammer out of commission, you can use this targeter to blow any exchange assets in the area sky high. Hit anything you can get in range of. Bigger the better. Just don't stand too close. I'll look forward to the light show. 
And another quest right over here. Oh, my lord. My lord, it's so good you're here. Band of filthy Jowers cracked into one of the Zerka Corporation's abandoned compounds we recently unearthed. Made off with every droid in the place. I suspect you're seeking my assistance. The Jowers may have foiled the ideal recovery of these artifacts, but that doesn't mean the Empire can't still benefit from the technology. You see, the stolen droids activated. Now they're systematically hunting down everything around the Jowers' derelict sand crawler. I've observed their behaviors becoming refined, more efficient. Honestly, it looks like they're learning from trial and error. I find that somewhat intriguing. If these droids are adaptive and self-coordinating, their applications would be innumerable. Scanning the architecture of the droids' memory cores should give us more insight into their uniform design and their individual differences. Can the Reclamation Service count on your support? I will investigate this. It's unlikely that the droids will stand idle while you attempt to take a reading. Disabling them will be necessary. Just try not to damage their memory cores while you're taking the fight out of them. And I see something right here. That is a lore object. We will come back to that here in just a second. I want to see if there's a speeder. Maybe, maybe. There is a speeder. Awesome. Alright, so let's get back to that lore object. That one, I... I think I do have it on my main, but uh, lucky, I, luckily I saw that because that was not one of the lore objects I was counting on for this uh, this series. So good thing we found that. Let's go ahead and open up the map and see where we're at. And on the big map, if you start out in the spaceport, you can hop on this speeder. And the speeder right here, most annex, you may not have that yet. If not, start out here and just work your way all the way around to here. And here is the actual map that we're on, Mos Anek. So from this speeder, you, you can come from here. Like I said, you may not have this one open yet. So you can come from here and work your way all the way around to where we're at now, Mos Anek. And right in front of me is the Imperial Reclamation Service lore object. And like I said, I wasn't I wasn't counting on that one, so that uh, is actually an extra bonus for us. All right, let's see what we got. We have a lot of quests to do, and I think that's probably more than I'm going to want to actually put on this episode because this is getting kind of long as it is. So, until next time, this is Scully signing out.